Good morning, you guys. Happy Monday. Today's quote of the day is, the bad news is time flies. The good news is you're the pilot by Michael Altshuler. Here's today's outfit, guys. Shirt I bought in Russia. Pants forever, or American Eagle. And these new shoes that I thrifted. And then these earrings that my bestie got me from Paris. Aren't they so cute? <gasps> I literally just, are you kidding me? I literally just ripped, do you guys see? I just ripped a hole in my pants. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go change now. <laughs> quote of the day is good decisions come from experience and experience comes from making bad decisions by Mark Twain and I don't know I just I like I like that quote a lot because I think that sometimes when faced with a decision if we haven't had one before it's hard to know what is the right decision and it's just kind of a reminder that it's okay to you know it's okay to make bad choices and to fail because that's how we learn how to make better choices and to succeed, so yeah, happy, what day is today? Happy Tuesday. Alright guys, just had my little Spanish lesson. It was early, but it got my brain going, but now I'm just kind of feeling weird, but we're gonna go to the gym. Let's go do glutes. It's life. Hi guys, I thought I'd do a quick check-in today. So I had lab, lab was really awesome. We inserted our plasmids into E. coli. So I'm gonna go back tomorrow and see if it worked. Um, so I had that this afternoon after my classes. And then I've just been here all afternoon doing work. I finished, I did some readings and now I'm sewing my point shoes while watching a video for my Spanish class. But yeah, it's time to go to dinner now and then I'm going to rehearsal. So I probably won't see you guys till after rehearsal. Um, yeah, but it's been a good day. Um, just kind of squeezing in work wherever I can. And yeah, hoping to get these point shoes sewed in the next couple of days so I can actually start breaking them in. But yeah, just been ha I just decided to have a chill afternoon at my desk because we finished lab at like three and I was like, I don't really want to go to the coffee shop or the library. So I've just been sitting here and it's been nice, but let's go eat some food. Wednesday. Today's quote of the day is don't trade your authenticity for approval. I know it's a little cheesy but it's just something I always remind myself because I it's so easy to change small things about yourself to kind of fit in with the crowd but it's so much more important to be yourself and be who you are and who you want to be and so just a little reminder. Happy Wednesday. Today's a busy day. Let's get going. Okay guys, I just had my classes for the day and I'm trying to show you my outfit every day. So here's today's outfit. This sweater dress that I got from 
Goodwill. I think it's so cute with these tights and these docks. But I'm changing into my dance clothes now, so yeah. Hi guys, I thought I'd update you. I've been working a lot in my room this week. I don't know if that means I'm getting lazier or just I like hair more. But um, I had classes this morning and I've just been here doing some work after lunch. Um, I have dance 3.30, 5.30 today and we're like doing it with our guest choreographer. So like I really gotta be on time. So I'm just gonna have a little yogurt as a pre-dance snack. Happy Thursday. I slept in. I slept like nine hours last night, but I'm feeling so good, so rested. Um, today's quote of the day is Billy Joel, one of my favorite songs, my top song last year on Spotify, and it is Slow Down, You're Doing Fine. You can't be everything you want to be before it's time. I just love that one because I think a lot of times I'm, oh my god, like... I need to do this, I need to do this if I want to get to med school. I, I need to be working all these jobs and all these things. And like sometimes you just need to slow down and remind yourself that you're doing fine. You're doing more than fine. And yeah, anyways, today's gonna be an awesome day, a busy day. I'm super well rested for it, so that's exciting. And I'm trying a new thing with my TikToks where I'm gonna try and do every other day a vlog and a photo reel, or maybe not every other day, but just like Today, I'm like kind of behind on the vlogs on TikTok and I feel like today's gonna be the same as every other day, so I'm gonna do a photo reel instead. So try I'm trying to mix it up a little bit to see if that helps me at all, but anyways, yeah. wearing this Carhartt shirt that I thrifted, these cargo pants that I thrifted, and this um, turtleneck, striped turtleneck that I also thrifted. I just felt like dressing like a boy today, and I really like this outfit. I feel super comfy and chilling in, but I'm gonna change into sweatpants now. Hi guys, I thought I would update you. So this morning after the gym, I had my Spanish class, then I got lunch, and then just now I just did, um, we had to do something in lab. Our experiment isn't working out how we wanted, so hopefully we can figure it out. But then I went to an office hours, and now I was gonna go to a coffee shop, like literally just for the vlog, because I wanted to make it more interesting. But I only have like an hour and a half chunk of time right now, so, I decided to just stay in my room to do work. I'm not even going to the library. Yeah, I hope you guys don't mind. No cute montages, but I'll definitely go to the library like this weekend. So I've just been loving doing work at my little desk lately. It's just so like cozy and comfortable. So yeah, anyways, we're gonna do um, some physiology reading right now. So let's get to it. Hi guys, so I just had my first, um, my new student work job is like, it's called a safety officer. Basically, every club team has like a safety officer and we are in charge of like doing the trainings for those safety officers, just kind of like reminding people of things that are important to think of based on the season that we're in. Um, and we also teach the CPR classes, so if I'm ever talking about that position while I'm 
vlogging. That's what I'm referring to. So we just had our little like safety officer training. Went well. I've got my little drink for the, I love a drink. Like I love having a little sippy. And so I was so happy to remember that I have um, Diet 7 Up for the road. Um, I'm driving now about 50 minutes to go have dinner with my stepdad. I need to scrape off some ice with my stepdad and my grandma um, because she just turned 95. So let's go to dinner. I'm running a little late. I'm not gonna speed, but I do need to leave. So let's go. Oh, it's cold. Heat going up. Let's turn on some Taylor Swift and hit the road. I'm excited. Today like worked out really well because I actually am not like super pressed for homework or studying this week. Next week is when I'm gonna be kind of pressed. So the timing worked out because most Thursdays, I'm like not able to go and drive two hours of the day, but today, it works out. Let's go. Good morning, you guys. Happy Friday. Today's Friday. Happy Friday. Um, today's quote of the day. So there are two. The first one is consume less, create more. I love this reminder, um, whether it's something like in the digital space, like consuming less and creating more is something I'm trying to focus on, but also just in life in general, um, consuming less and sort of saying no to capitalism. Yeah, that's one of the quotes. And then the other one is, wanting to be someone else is a waste of the person you are by Marilyn Monroe. And I love that. It's always good to stay true to yourself. Um, I've had an awesome day today. Biochem was awesome. Now I have like two hours before skiing. I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna drive myself or if I'm going to go with some friends. Not sure yet, but obviously I'll decide in the next few hours. But for now, we're gonna have a little work session from home. Happy, happy Friday. I added some of my oat milk um, brown sugar creamer in my coffee. Amazing, so good. Mm. All right, let's grind before the weekend. Guys, I'm doing my human fist reading. Look how pretty this is. Like the sun coming in with my flowers. Ah! Life is good, man. I'm reading about EKGs, which is actually so interesting because um, when I worked at the emergency department, like I did EKGs all day and I had like an idea of how they worked, but now I'm like learning about like the P, the P wave, the QRS and the T wave. And it's like, it's just so interesting because I like feel like I've like I've been in the field with it and now I'm like understanding how it works. So that's a sleigh. That's the sleigh of the day. Oh, oh I love them. Hi guys, we are heading to skiing. I decided to drive by myself this week because the bus did me dirty last week and I'm also just like feeling like being a solo girl. Um, I might end up meeting up with my friend and driving her home so that she doesn't have to take the bus But I feel like kind of going on my own and at least getting a few runs in on my own um, So yeah, let's head to Welch Village. I'm so excited. It's a beautiful sunny day I got a little bit of homework done like I'm just feeling I'm just feeling really good. So let's go skiing. Yay! Small Diet Coke. Small Diet Coke. And a cheeseburger with no meat. So just like the bun and the cheese. All right, perfect. Got it up for you. The comes out to 55 at the first window. Okay, thank you. A cheeseburger. No. Burger. to dance for like four hours. Let's go.
Hey besties. Oh my god, I need to take off my makeup. Anyways, I'm trying to record. I don't know if anyone out there is sleeping, but um, I'm home. I went out with Toya. It was so much fun. And I'm in my grandma era because it's 11 p.m. on a Saturday and I'm about to fold my laundry and go to bed. I just, I'm not feeling like doing anything crazy. So yeah, I'm in my self-care era. I had so much fun catching up with tea and now let's have a little cleaning moment and then go the frick to bed because I'm exhausted. Guys, this might be like so out of pocket, but like I just put this leotard in the laundry and it smelled like cat pee. And I think like there's a couple dance things that have just like randomly smelled like cat pee that I, I haven't worn them in so long. Like I don't even think I, I think I've like just like not worn them. Like I packed them like a year ago and never worn them. And I think like my cat might have peed on a suitcase like last year and then I brought it here and there's some things like I think almost everything has been washed now but like that leotard it's just been like sitting with cat pee I just don't know how to feel about that anyways um I was gonna share with you guys as I'm pulling laundry um just because I feel like this vlog is really short one of my new mottos is just only doing things that I want to do Okay, basically what I'm trying to say is obviously like, there are certain things that come along with doing things that you want to do that you might not want to do. I really want to have a Spanish minor and I don't want to do this test that I have to do tomorrow, but like I have to do it. So like I'm not doing things that I don't want to do in terms of like socializing. Like I'm not going to go hang out with friends right now because like I just like genuinely don't want to. Like I love my friends, but I'm just like I want to fold my laundry and go to bed. What's another example? I was talking to my friend about this and I feel like I put it way more eloquently, but you're allowed to like exist and you're allowed to do the things you want to do. Is that, a, that's not, that's probably the least profound thing I've ever said. I'm not sure. I'm really not putting this in a good way. I need to go to bed. I'm So it's about 1 30 now. I um, did some homework this morning, then I went to the rec. I just finished taking a shower and eating lunch, and now I'm doing a quick Starbucks run with my friend, and then we're gonna go to the library. So little little treat, and then it's grind time. Hi guys. I haven't vlogged much today. I, battery's flashing, let me make this quick. I've just kind of been in a little bit of a funk, just feeling pretty blah. Um, I can't really put my finger on why, like nothing is inherently wrong. I'm not like super stressed about anything right now. I do have a lot on my plate, but like it's all manageable, but I'm just, I'm just feeling kind of down. I haven't had the best day today and it happens. Um, I'm always trying to romanticize my life and sometimes it doesn't work out. Um, I just like, I just have so much to do and lab didn't go well today. And so I just, anyways, I don't want to complain too much, but I just haven't had the most awesome day, but I thought I would share this with you guys because it's just a reminder that um, it's okay to have down days and things are not always going to be going your way and not every day can be perfect. Um, I always make an effort to live every day to the fullest. Um, because you never know what could happen, but sometimes it just not every day is perfect. So um, I've decided to call it a day. It's 8 30. I'm gonna do a little bit of organization, watch some new girl, and just try and kind of pull myself out of this funk that I'm feeling. So yeah, I'm hoping to go to bed at 9 30 so I can wake up at 5 30 and have a really productive morning because I just I just have so much on my plate right now. Um, but yeah, if you guys ever feel that kind of like blah, like just not feeling super good or excited about things, um, you're not alone and it happens to all of us. <laughs> 